I'm hyped up on caffeine or something. I'm just feeling like plumbing all night. This was the original drain setup. Set up something like that. This is going to be the new drain setup right here. Look at how good that looks compared to what it did look. <laughs> Get this drain hooked up. Starting with the old P trap. I'm just going to throw this in here just like that. Everything is going to be connected loosely at this point. The way that this gasket goes, it's just like that right inside of this extension piece. And then you slip this on from the underside and just thread it on. I don't really do a lot of measuring. I just kind of eyeball this stuff. All right, throw that on there. So we have our, ah, I just stuck my finger in that nastiness. Ugh. Ugh. So what we probably will have to do is bring this out a little bit and turn it. All right, so let's take this right here, right here. Okay. 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 All right, that side is getting there. And this side, same thing. We're just going to eyeball it, make sure that this T piece is uh, pretty straight. And then, so we're about right there. This is really precise. You have a little bit of flex, you have a little bit of flexibility, so. All right. So now we are definitely too far over. Loosen this right here. Loosen this big old. Ah! You dirty dog. Somebody way over tightened that. Maybe it's sealed up with grease. I don't know. It looks like somebody's pouring, pouring grease down here at some point. Don't do that. Don't pour grease down your drains. It's terrible. People do it all the time and I don't understand why. All right, this isn't working out very well. What's going on? Okay, change of plans. I don't have another inch and a half P-trap. Um, <clears throat> this P-trap uh, is not really going to work, but what I do have, let me show you guys. I have a longer one of these bad boys. It's more, more than one way to, I guess, hook up a sink. I normally they say skin a cat, but I don't know how many people. Not sure how many people skin cats, but anyways, beyond the point. Right there, right there. Eyeballing. Who's eyeballing? Who's eyeballing who? Alright. So you do is find your cut spot on here. Marked it with my finger. And trim it. Now I did trim that a little bit long. I can always come back and trim it, but I can't add to it. Just a heads up. Right there. Right there. This trap is not wanting to cooperate. Just like that and then take this one do the same thing it's dry fit I think we're a little tight in here probably have to trim one of these just go around here trim a little bit all right just like that all right so take it all back apart once you have it dry fitted, now it goes into the pipe just like that. And then this goes in. And then you screw it on. But when you get that sticker off, like, wow, that one came off. Apply a little bit of pipe dope to this side. I do a little bit on this back side too. Why not? It's white. It doesn't look bad. It's, yeah. And then take your. I do like the uh, green gaskets better, but this is all I have right now. So this is what's going on here. Whoa. So apply a little bit to the top right there. And that's just gonna add that much more of ceiling power. 
all you do, screw it on, just like that. I just go, that's it. So this is our T piece right here. And it goes just like that. What I'm gonna do is take a nut and then take a ring just like that. And I'm gonna put it right, slide it right up here. These are the washers I like better. They seem more pliable, flexible, they just seem like they seal better. And I'm gonna push it up. Oh, you don't have to go crazy. I'm gonna take the pipe dope again. I'm just gonna apply a little bit on there, and then when you pull it down, it will get on there. Do the same thing on the other side. All right, and then you can slip that up there, but don't do it yet. Nut and washers on your side pieces, just like that. Same thing, apply a little pipe dope, and then when you smash it together, it'll bring the pipe dope towards the joint and seal it up like that so then when you bring the green washer see how that's sealed up boom so then you have a little bit of piped up in there when you tighten it up it's gonna squeeze in there seal it up tight this side pop it on there pop on your green washer maybe get on there get on there all right all right this is looking good a little bit of pipe dope. Just a personal thing. For myself, uh, being a landlord, tenants do like to take, um, try to fix their own plumbing, which sometimes just honestly creates more problems. And uh, I normally don't use this type of trap, this type of trap but this is the way they were set up, so I'm just gonna go ahead and use it. So what you do is you uh, pop it on here just like that. I normally use a glue type trap, and then you're going to put your hand on the underside, bring this down, and tighten it up. Do the same thing on the other side. Push up on the bottom and tighten up. this nut right here now you're going to want to position that a little bit make sure it's straight I want to go ahead and get everything put on so next I'm putting on the nut and washer for down here at the bottom boom just like that slide that on there and then this already has the old uh, p-trap already has the washer and stuff on there I did um, wipe it off, clean it up. Okay, slide that back off, slide that on. Do not pour grease down your drains. I don't know how many people do. Or they're like, oh, I was just grinding up some meatloaf in the garbage disposal. I don't know why my drain clogged. Meatloaf's pretty greasy. Yeah, all right. Getting there, almost done with this job. I will install the, uh, I'll, I'll bring you guys back tomorrow. Uh, it's getting kind of late, but I'll bring you guys back tomorrow with me and we will install those two um, supply lines and caulk the top. But I just wanted to get all this drain wrapped up tonight. Make sure I didn't need anything from the parts store. Just lightly snug those up. Just like that. All right, that's it. And last two. These two right here, These are, that's the order I like to go in because this gives you pivot to move your P-trap around. So it's just the order I like to go in. And all you'll do is, whoop, wrong way. Lightly snug. Uh, by lightly snugging these, it keeps tenants out of there. Or keep your wife out of there, I don't know. Keep somebody out of there.